Let's talk about the solar eclipse in April and May. We have a solar eclipse in Taurus. Now you're going to find that you will have a brand new beginning. You will not be building on a beginning that you've previously had. This is going to be a clean slate. You were building on something brand new. And this is going to occur in the area of your natal chart where Taurus is present. For example, if Taurus is in your 10th house, 10th house symbolizes your career, you're going to find brand new growth and expansion and success in your career. This solar eclipse is occurring in the second decan of Taurus. So you're going to find that you're able Able to balance your success with your personal life. So you're going to be working hard, but playing hard. You're going to be having fun. You're going to be celebrating your successes, but you're also going to be grinding as well. So I mentioned that you will be successful and this is partly due to you becoming a lot wiser. You're going to find that you are gaining a lot of knowledge, which will be necessary for you to have this transformation. So you are going to rise to success, but this ascent is going to be slow and steady. You're going to find that you'll have to be a bit patient. You're going to be developing a plan and you're going to be building on that plan and working towards that goal over the next couple of months. You may also find that you're going against your morals or your previous belief systems in order to attain the success. Another interesting thing that's going to happen is we have Venus conjunct Neptune in Pisces. This is such a beautiful transit. This is dreamy. Neptune is the planet of dreams. Venus is a planet of harmony, beauty, abundance, and this is happening in the dreamy house of Pisces. So you're going to find that you're able to manifest something that you want in the Taurus area of your chart into existence. Also, a lot of the planets are going to be exalted in their signs. For example, Saturn is going to be in Aquarius, Venus and Jupiter are going to be in Pisces, so the planets are most happy in these signs. But we do have Saturn opposite the eclipse, so this can cause a lot of worry, this can cause stress and doubts about your abilities. But overall, you're going to find that you are able to lay down the groundwork right now. You are creating a stable, beautiful foundation that will allow you to work on your goals over the next couple of months, and you will be able to effectively get these goals done. You will be able to work towards these goals without burning out because you will have a perfect work-life balance, but work Working towards these goals will not be easy. It will be very intense. You will be hustling. So you'll find that you are putting in a lot of hard work. It will not be an easy transition, but it will be worth it. Now, since this eclipse is occurring in Taurus, which represents finances, you may find that there's a lot of financial news or news about the economy around this time. So make sure you check out which house Taurus falls in in your natal chart to see how the eclipse is going to affect you. Taurus falls in my first house, so I'm going to have a large transformation around self-identity, my physical appearance, and my goals.